you gotta be cool, calm, collect, and look your feet. Hey everybody, it's Nate. So the other day I was just doing my thing here at the middle school and saw an awesome use of some basic tools done in a, in a way that I thought was so effective, I had to share. So with permission of the genius who created this, Ms. Benjamin, I wanna show you an innovative way to combine YouTube and Google Sheets for differentiation. Now this worked obviously for her class, but this is something that could be easily modified and used in any class. So if you can't think of a way to use this, you need to see a doctor. Let's take a look. Um, so I, I do not know why my video, trust me, I'm not trying to put my own video up there. This has just been popping up. Um, so she was talking about doing essays, right, in her class. And because she knows her stuff, she knew what kids would maybe need, there we go, what kids would need to have help with. And so she found some common things that kid might, kids might struggle with, right? And she took some data, so she's not just like focusing on the wrong things, she's focusing what the kids need help with. And because why not, she made this handy dandy little chart, so you can just take a look here, you know, what were the most needed things according to the kids. Well, where the magic happens is, it, you know, there's a billion YouTube videos. Nobody's disputing that. But you can't just say, hey, go to YouTube and find help. That might help for some kids, but some kids, they're going to go and they're going to find something that's not even relevant or they're going to get distracted or whatever. So Miss Benjamin, she knows the good videos. She knows the ones that are going to help. So she, she collected the videos. This would be an alternative to making YouTube playlists. And she put the common struggles, right? And then videos the kids could go to. So when I was in this class, I was like, what, this is so cool. And the kids, she's like, okay, kids, so you know what your struggles are. Let's, let's see how you can improve your writing. So the kids go, they look at, oh, I struggle with hooks. Boom, if you're struggling with hooks, click, brother, and it's done. So uh, you all have unique curriculum, but when you find a great YouTube video and you put it on, um, you know, you put it on your Google Classroom, that's cool, but it kind of gets lost in the stream. You might consider how could you build something like this, maybe like every gigantic topic that you use in the in the year and just start this massive YouTube library for quick reference later so you don't have to look it up. You could even come down to the bottom here and create a new sheet, right? And you could say, I want to create a sheet for, you know, a certain unit or a certain, you know, semester, or whatever. So you, you could build the YouTube video archive of your dreams that is customized just for your class. So anyways, thanks, Ms. Benjamin, for letting me share this. Thanks for inventing it or doing it. Uh, thanks, everybody, for watching this video. Thanks to America. Thanks to everybody who does cool stuff. Keep rocking on and let me know if I can do anything to help you in the future. All right. Have a good day. This is Mr. Waite signing off. Bye.